Us Americans love the freedom of personal transportation. We buy cars and trucks that can carry half a dozen people, hundreds of miles, and at speeds well above the legal limit. Unfortunately, though, this freedom comes at a cost to each of us as individuals and a society as a whole. First of all, cars are very expensive. How many hours out of the week are you working just to support your driving habits? On these cars, they burn a lot of fuel. Americans use more oil than anyone else in the world. What's more, this oil pollutes our air and contributes to global warming. In the U.S., road vehicles account for one-fifth of the greenhouse gas emissions. And we will increasingly have to rely on foreign countries to supply our oil, which, as it turns out, is slated to run out in the coming decades. Oil is still cheap and very effective, but in the long run, I don't think it's worth it. So that begs the question. How do we preserve our freedom of personal transportation without using so much oil? Hi, my name is Eric Van Gelder, and this is a vehicle that I built, a pedal electric tricycle. I notice that we don't use our vehicles to the specifications they're designed for, carrying only one or two people, up to 30 miles a day on average. So I designed the pedal electric tricycle, or PET, to meet these specifications while maximizing energy efficiency. The Pell Electric Tricycle can carry two people as well as 200 pounds of cargo at up to 25 miles per hour for 30 miles on a, on a single charge. Five horsepower of electric hub motors in the front wheels are powered by two kilowatt hours of sealed lead acid batteries at 48 volts. The rear wheel is pedal powered to increase its range and offer a workout to the driver. The all-wheel suspension combined with its novel tilting and locked driving modes make for a seriously smooth ride. In energy testing for stop-and-go driving, the PET achieves 40 watt-hours per mile or an energy equivalent of 700 miles per gallon. The PET is not yet for sale, but to give you an idea of how much one might cost, the price for all the components combined to build this prototype was only $5,000. As a proof of concept vehicle, the PET shows that indeed there is an alternative to burning piles of fossil fuels just to get around. Thanks for watching.